In this video, I'll show you how to create a database using a tool called PHP My Admin. Note that if you have the ability to create a database using your control panel, you should use that method instead of this one, as I demonstrated in the previous video. Some control panels, such as cPanel, do not allow you to create a database in PHP My Admin. Start by logging into PHP My Admin using the details provided by your host. The first step is to create a new database. This option appears on the first page, and all you have to do is enter a name. I'll choose the name Video Demo, and enter that here, and click the Create button. Now we need to create a user for the database. Click the Home button in the top left, and then Privileges. Scroll down if necessary and click Add a new user. On this page, enter a username. I'll use Demo. You can leave the host option at Any Host. Then decide on a password and enter it here. And enter it again here. Leave all the other settings and click the Go button. The last step is to assign privileges to the user. Do not use this global privileges option. Instead, go to this box and choose the database you previously created. This action will refresh the page and you can see up the top that we're editing the privileges for this user on this database. Click the check all link and then the go button here. That's all there is to creating a database using PHP My Admin. Make sure you make a note of the database name, the username and the username password. The next video discusses a different database setup so skip ahead to lesson 4E where I show you how to get your installation of Joomla working.